How's it going guys and welcome back to Walking Dead. This is recorded right after the previous episode, part, whatever, and let's get started. I talked for everything, I looked at everything, and where did they go? Well, might as well examine everything here. Huh. Crawford must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. Alrighty. Anything else I can look at? Big, the big giant X here. Better ignore that. Look at the empty locker. Empty. The alleyway to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? Fine. Jeez. Well, not. Oh, that's the men's bathroom. I'm coming. I can check the bathroom later. Shell casings all over. Whatever happened here wasn't good. Can I pick them up? I've already been fired. They're worthless. What? Well, I could use it for distractions or whatever. She went this way, right? Let's just follow her. I think she went this way. Oh, yeah, um. Okay, that should do it. Let's go. This must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. But where the hell is Molly? When she went that way, didn't she? She called out for us, didn't Molly, she? You out here? Molly? I thought you went out here. Guess I'm not going that way. Apparently not. So auto shop is like this why? Or is it this? What? Oh, okay, I'm just gonna... Okay, that's just my only way. Look at the sign. Delivery is made in the rear. Authorized oh, no, motor. must be down this way. Ah! Well, I'm not lost at least. What the... Robotic? Molly! Don't sneak on me on that cat! Ah. Herman's. This is the place I'm looking for. Looters will be shot on sight. Ugh. Damn. Well, good thing they're walkers now. Not like I gotta need it. Oh, there's a TV here. No, let's crawl up the hole and see what we can get out of this. Looks sturdy. I think. Ah, yeah, it does. Well, one way check. Must be the entrance to that auto shop where Bree said we'd find that battery. Let's open it then. Molly, don't come sneaking up on me. Damn, it's jammed tight. Don't give this black man a heart attack, man. Where, where are you, Molly? I saw a shadow. It better be you. Ah, more zombies. Better not get too close. Ah, oh, let's see here. Must be something I can use around. Whoa! Okay, stop the fucker in the head. He's mine. Okay. Nice to see you. Uh, did you know that guy? What? I think you got it. One more. Yeah, I know I'm joking around here. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. Did he abuse you? When you were a child did in this school? This in? Yeah. But the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Oh, my mandiness. Not a problem. Look what I found. Woo! Oh, yeah. That'll work. Nice job, Ma. 
Uh oh. Looks like I have to be tapping. It's time to tap. I'm ready with the cue. Uh oh. This is Nick looking good. Come on. Yeah, I, I won't tap it. Oh, come on. You wasted time looking at it. <gasps> yep, I'm ready. I'm ready. All right. Oh, you see that shit? Black power. <laughs> Oh yeah, you had to stop the head, you fucker! How about re removing that shit? Kick it! Oh no, there will be crawling. Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Yeah, I'll trust you with that. You psycho bitch. Okay. Looks like Crawford had their own semi trucks. Hey. That blinking must be an anti-theft system. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. I need to find a way to like disable the alarm. Looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. It's the panel that controls the hydraulic lift over there. Let's just inspect everything. More of Crawford's rules. How did anybody live like this? I'd rather take nope. my chances on the outside. So, Molly, do you know how to disable a... Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. Huh. No power. So, Molly, can I, like, borrow your knife? Huh. Let's open this. Is there anything sharp I can use here? Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Perfect. But this is... I could search, but I don't want to trigger the alarm. So, Molly, do you have a knife? Something you need? Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. You name it Hilda? Hilda. That's what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Fair her? Fair enough. I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. What you let me borrow her for? I got your promise now. Not a scratch. <laughs> ha! No deal! You made a deal with a black man! <laughs> that should lower the car. I did it. Whoa, whoa! That's probably not good. No shit! Um, shit? I'll try to hold them off. Hurry! There's the battery. Finally, something goes right. Uh, 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 take this off. Yeah, yeah, unplug that shit. Oh, look at my time, man. Still attached to the terminals. What? The? What do I do? Oh shit, oh, yeah, take it out. I'm, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Got that one off. I'm panicking like a motherfucker. Okay. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. But the battery's heavy as okay, fuck. Follow me. Alrighty. Move your ass. Yeah, I'm, I can parkour and shit. Oh, wait, there's a ladder here. No problem. Oh, did I. Jump. Skyline. Alrighty. It's shot. Shoot it out. I'm okay. A little health box. Oh! Now we ninja. Okay, so now we're on a roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. I probably should have asked her about the guy, but I don't want to like pry too much of her back life. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump. What did you call me? Chicken. Well, now that you mention it. <laughs>
This black man got the skills. Guess that's what you get for the black guy beating you up before. Don't doubt my skills. Come on. Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Well, throw the Wait, battery. You still got the battery. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Okay. Molly! Damn it, what the hell is she doing? Should I check up on the others, I guess? Logan? Is Wolverine in there? Too bad I don't know the combination to any of these. Ha! Can't open it without the combination. I know the company. Oh, I don't. I don't. Should we check on the others? What the? Oh, hey. You stuck? You guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. Okie dokie. Guess you don't need my help. There's a soda machine. Since when did schools have soda machines? My school didn't have one. Guess they're not cool enough. Not going out again. There was a door here. No, I can't go that way. I guess I'll go back. Little help! What? Little help here! Oh! No! No! Q! 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 Spam Q! Fuck! The doors won't close all the way! Punch the fucker! Oh, the axe! Ah, Q again! Oh, baby! Woo! That was too cool. Damn well better. There's so many of them. You got the fuel. Where'd I go, Let's Kenny? Let's not start high-fiving each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the class. Don't leave a brother hanging! Let's these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. Don't leave a brother hanging. You better high five me when we're done. You're back. Yeah, and we made out pretty good too. Great work, Kenny. Thanks. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. <laughs> They're bonding. Get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She better be. Bree? Hey, Lee. Thanks for all your help back there. I don't think we would have made it without you. No problem. We're all on the same team. Hell yeah. So you're a cancer survivor, like Vernon and the others. Yeah, I was diagnosed when I was in college. Been getting treatment ever since. Just when I was starting to get better, when I thought there might be some hope, all this happened. Well, you got long hair, so the cancer must have been over for a long time. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out, huh? How long have you known Vernon? Couple of years. He ran our support group. He was really great helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? Mm -hmm. I don't know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one who held us together kept us alive what do you think about this whole Crawford situation I'd rather not talk about it too many awful memories even being back here gives me a bad feeling even now with everyone dead I got no sympathy for what happened to these people they weeded out the sick and the old even children those least able to defend themselves so that they could save their own skins whatever happened here however Crawford fell I consider it poetic justice damn girl that's cool. It's how I feel. If you'd seen what I seen, you'd feel the same. Okay. I, I shouldn't blame you too much. I'm a little busy here, Lee. Maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. All right. I'll just speak with the other people. No problemo. It's like I'll just speak with Kenny. I can't speak with Kenny. I guess I'm done talking with these guys. How are you holding up, Clem? You okay, Clem? Yeah. Where's Molly? She had to go run an errand. She'll be back soon. I hope she's okay. She'll be fine. She's pretty tough. 
Just sit tight, okay? I need to go take care of a few things. All right. Should I help with the door? I think I'll help with the door here. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. You've seen her she skills? She your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, but what has she done for me lately? Uh, okay. Well, I couldn't blame you. We just kind of met her. But I, I, I'll, I'll believe in her. She got the skills. You've seen her parkour moves? Pak, pak or parkour. How do you pronounce it? Pak or parkour? I don't care. Let's go see if we can help the medicine team. Nope. <laughs> Let's check the bathroom. I'm gonna take a piss. Damn you, bladder! You tricked me! This place definitely has some major damage. Maybe I need to follow, like, Molly. Shit. What the f- Okay. Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. Uh, where should I go? Should I shoot them? That's not like the best idea here. How did they get in even? Okay, I got I don't see any other options here. Let's just shoot one of them then. Oh, you see that niggers? You see my Call of Duty skills here right here. I usually suck at Call of Duty. So oh, Counter Strike. <laughs> to be honest. What the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the mids? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Now we have Looks to find like a combination. All the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. There's no way we can bust it open. Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. I'm pretty sure Molly knows. Since she's like... Being... Have to take time to rest later, I like, think. suspicious and shit. What is this? A copy machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. What do you want, copy my butt? I'll... Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. It's just worth a look. Not working. I shouldn't go outside. Phones probably haven't worked in months. It's worth a look. Looks like some kind of medical file. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? Is that the combination? 19... It's a medical file for a woman named Correa. Okay. Now I need to find some tape player. Camcorder? Oh! No tape inside. But I just found a tape. Insert it. Oh, let's see what this gives me. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547. Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Wait, she looked black Why in the are you file. Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh! Oh God, oh God, oh God. And you're the father! Okay, As who you is know, it? All the rules are very clear. 
The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. Oh, abortion! I want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, come on! You should have... I want to see the password here. Ah, oh, he almost did it. Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Abortion like center? Like said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search oh! see what he's got on him. Oh! I guess I see what Molly's problem is now. There's dried blood on this printout. And on the floor. Looks like a trail of it from the safe to the camera over there. Then out the door. What the hell happened here? I can't fire now. Shoot the safe? Uh, let's not attract more attention, shall we? Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. Well... You never know what you have overlooked. Uh, already cleaned out. Meh. Let's look at this sonogram. What's this on the floor? It's a sonogram. Yeah. Let's talk to Krista. Hey, Let's Krista. Bond a little. Yeah. Are you feeling okay? I'm fine. Why are you asking me that? It's just that you've been looking a little pale the past couple of days. You've been throwing up. Oh, you... come on. You just dug up a rotting dog carcass. I'm surprised we weren't all throwing up. Lee, I'm fine. Quit worrying about me, okay? Worry about Omid. We've got to get him these meds. Are you making any progress with the safe? No. Without the combination, I don't know how we're going to get this damn thing open. If we don't get back to Omid with some medicine soon... It's okay. We'll figure it out. Don't worry, girl. I hope I did the right thing bringing Clementine with us. This place isn't exactly safe. Then why did you? Because leaving her alone with Omi didn't seem any safer. What's that supposed to mean? Well, he's injured! No offense, Krista, but Omid's pretty sick. If he dies with Clementine alone in the house with that him... That is not gonna happen. Do you hear me? That is not going to happen. We're going to get these meds to Omid, and he's going to be fine. He's going to be fine! You're right. I'm sorry. You should probably should have no, said it the other I way. I just want to get back to Omid. Let me do my thing, all right? Okay. Well, I'm girl. I'm gonna let you do your thing. <laughs> I'm gonna stop here. I'm gonna high five you on my webcam. What am I doing? Somebody's it's a zombie, dude. Can't you tell? I can tell. What the fuck? This place is infected. 